da 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 instead going to talk about uh soul food so what is soul food i'm just going to read from uh from wikipedia soul food is an ethnic cuisine ethnic uh, traditionally prepared and eaten by African Americans, uh, originally from the southern parts of the United States, the southern states, but it's uh, but it's spread all over. I mean, after a hundred years, it's spread all over uh, all of the the U.S. Um, the cuisine originated with the foods that were given to black slaves by their white owners on southern plantations. Um, however, it was also strongly influenced by the traditional cuisines of West Africa and the Native Americans. And so there's kind of, it's like a cocktail. It's a blend of different cuisines all coming together that could be prepared by the slaves during this period in, in America's uh, dark history. And, and it's kind of carried over and evolved over the decades uh, up until today, and it is a it is a race food. Uh, of course, anybody can enjoy it, right? But but it is it has to be a food that comes from America's slave past in the South. Now, what is it? Well, it's it's a lot of things. It's a lot of different foods. It's generally only foods that would grow in America, so it's not going to be, you know, sushi or baklava or something like that. Um, so it's going to be, you know, a lot of uh, a lot of the uh, grasses and uh, vegetables and fruits, or grains um, that that are originally from here. Um, it's going to be bird uh, and pork. Um, that that is or could be prepared here. So yeah, it's going to be those kinds of food. And so, in the spirit of celebrating soul food, I chose the three most common dishes in soul food. Yeah, yeah. So let's get started. Uh, let's see. The first one is collard greens that's right collard greens now it's a little hard to explain <laughs> what collard greens are remember what i told you is this all has to come from uh, america from grown uh, native native to america american soil right so a collard green is a lot like a lettuce or a cabbage. It's kind of like a thick, a thick, um, more more rough uh, cabbage. So it, you can't eat it raw, and you can't steam it. You, you have to pan fry it. You have to pan fry it. And um, this this uh, vegetable, this this leafy green vegetable, is really tough to cook. So kind of you have to use a lot of oil, and you have to cook it slowly for kind of a long time, compared to other cat like cabbage and other green vegetables like spinach, or kale or okra or things like that. So collard greens takes a little bit longer because it's tougher, and and you can't just eat it plain because it doesn't taste fair it doesn't have a lot of flavor so generally uh southern families will add um onion to it they'll fry they'll chop and stir some stir fry some onion with it and a uh, bacon or pork with it and the then the fat and the juices from the onion and from the bacon and the or the pork uh, will soak into the collard green, and then that that is uh, that is what is served. Yeah, collard greens, and sometimes people will add a little bit of a spice to it, a little spice, because southern food sometimes can be very spicy, very hot. So they'll add a little bit of cayenne, or some other sort of a spicy pepper. To make to give it up just a little bit of a spice 
to it. A little, a little bit of uh, hot, hot and heat to it uh, when you're eating it. So that is collard greens. Yeah, one dish that is very common in soul food.